The following video is an introduction to the Doig Vector Animator app on the iPad. This is a cool application I've used to create drawings and animations and place them on the web, in particular on YouTube. Let's begin by tapping the doink icon. This pulls up my drawings and compositions. Drawings are the use of brush strokes and geometric shapes to create drawings. Examples include a flower, a ball, a yoga pose, a hand, characters, common objects like a key, geometric shapes, a car, a kite, a wheel, and a balloon. Let's look at one of the drawings in particular to show how you create these and then how they can combine to form an animation. Let's look at a hand. Each hand is drawn in a frame and by changing the configuration of the hand I can create the sensation of movement and thus an animation. Now if I play this you can see I have the finger wiggling. Compositions represent the com comb combination of drawings and other compositions to form animations. Let's look at the ball and here we have an animation with the ball falling and then bouncing off the floor. This is defined by four time segments and each time segment represents the particular image and its path in motion and then the change in shape of that over time so if I demonstrate this by slowly moving through these time segments you can see the ball falling and elongating then flattening as it hits the floor then as it rebounds, elongating again, and finally coming back to its original shape. I can replay this in real time, and you can see the motion of the ball. Now let's look at a different composition. In this case I have a car driving through the mountains, and this is represented by two timelines, one representing the scene, which is the mountain scene, and the other the car itself. And that if I follow the motion over time, I see the car going along the road, stopping, and then we have a close up, and the scene enlarges, and we come closer to the car. If I play this, you can see the actual motion. Now when I've finished, I can publish this. And by publishing this, I will get the following page. This allows me to view the animation itself, or to then share it. And in this case, I can share it on Twitter, Facebook, email, or I have previously shared this on YouTube. And to demonstrate that, I'll click on the link and you can see the actual YouTube animation. So this is the Doink Ve Vector Animator application. It's available in the iTunes Store and I've enjoyed using it to create animations and drawings and then sharing them. I hope you do as well.